Hi YouTube, hi everybody, hi, welcome to my subscribers. Um, once I get to 100 subscribers, I'm going to totally do that, one of those. Thank you, thank you. Or, you know, maybe once I get to director status. Director status, longer vlogs, woo! Um, yeah, I'm sorry that I sound a little bit weird. I just spent the whole day freaking protesting, yeah. Lower tuition fees, woo! Um, yeah, so today was the day of action, and a bunch of people all over Canada, and specifically in Halifax, all went and marched and protested and yelled and said, Err, we want tuitions lower and blah blah blah, because it, education is a right. It's not a privilege. It shouldn't be just for the rich, you know. I mean... Like, everyone should have the right to a post-secondary education. So, you know, lower the tuition fees. Um, yeah, so I spent, like, a very long time out in the cold yelling. So my throat is, like, gone. Uh, so yeah, that was, that was the majority of my morning. I feel really bad because I missed lecture today. Because basically what happened was I was really, really, really sick. Oh god, I was so sick Monday night. I, I had this migraine, and then since it's Monday, uh, quiet hours at school start kind of late, so um, the people are being really loud, and the loudness is making my headache worse. And that made me sick, because I'm one of those weird people that if I get a headache bad enough, I actually get physically sick. So then, you know, Tuesday... I have my classes in the afternoon, so it's okay by lunch. Because I'm usually, whenever I feel sick, I'm usually okay by lunch. And if not, then I just sleep. Whatever. But uh, I wasn't feeling good today. And so I um, pretty much stayed in bed until it was time for the protest. Kind of. I went to slunt. I went to sleep. <laughs> I trip over my tongue so often. Anyways, um, I went to lunch and then I went to the protest. Um, then after the protest, I hung out with people. And we drank hot chocolate, and we talked about the issues and all that good stuff. And uh, when that was over, I just I asked my friend if she wanted to come with me so I could go to the bank because I wanted to go to my bank so that I didn't get dinged when I was at the ATM. Because I mean, a buck fifty must not seem like much to everyone else, but I mean, the other day I used my laundry money so I could buy a carton of milk, and I had no laundry money, so a buck fifty means a lot to me. Unfortunately, every uh, bank, <laughs> um. Every bank that was my bank in the surrounding area uh, that I could find. I mean, like, I'm sure there was one in the city that wasn't, but I couldn't find one around me that wasn't broken. So I ended up having to go to a normal, another bank. And I got dinged, of course, for taking the money, but whatever. Got my hours for the week, and it's pretty good. Um, I work Friday night, I work Sunday afternoon, and then I work Thursday night, so it's, it's pretty solid. Uh, but the point is, I, uh, I asked her if she wanted to go with me. She's like, yeah, no, it's too late. And I said, too late? What What do you mean too late? She's like, well, I'm, it's not too late. I'm just, you know, I've just been going out in and out all day. And I just don't feel like going. So well, what time is it? And she's like, I, I don't know. So I went to my room. Found out it was already 5 o'clock. Supper's at like 5.30. So I missed supper. And ended up uh, just eating some leftover food in my room. But, um, yeah, after I got back in from checking my hours and getting the money and stuff, I went and I saw... Marat Saad. Oh my god, Marat Saad is freaking amazing. It's a great play. Um, it was performed by uh, my university's theatrical society, KTS. And it was an amazing play. It was really good. The people who put it on were just great. I loved it. I cannot articulate how awesome this is. I hope that everyone in the cast finds this vlog so they can know how much I love them because they were so amazing. I mean it like I just I I cannot articulate how much I loved that play. It was wonderful. Uh the worst thing is uh only bad thing. After the play, the director who I know, um she says, "Hey, you know, thanks. It was great having you in the audience." And I go, "Thanks." And I left. I I I wanted to tell them that I loved the play, but my brain it just I just couldn't say it. Oh, I feel so stupid now. But anyways, I loved it. Uh, then I went and I got milk and stuff. And really, I always hate it. Like, it's it's like two, three blocks from 
my res to the convenience store. And just, I hate having to bring stuff back. The worst thing is, of course, since I had the sign up all day, woo, and then I was carrying a banner too, my, um, my arms are kind of, you know, like, you know, yeah. I, I cannot articulate anything tonight. Oh, I feel so useless. Anyways, uh, my arms are kind of hurting, so, you know, carrying back, carry back, uh, four liters of milk, six liters of orange juice, and a 12 pack of Pepsi plus, uh, a box of popcorn. And, um, so that was pretty heavy. And then some other stuff happened, whatever, nothing really important. Um, yeah. I, uh, I don't really, oh yeah. Okay, going to try to keep this so that no one can figure out exactly what I'm saying because I don't want people to figure out what I'm talking about. But basically, um, I have a crush on a guy, and it sucks. Because it's not like it's like, because it's not like a guy at work, it's kind of a guy here at school, and um, I, I don't want to have a crush on a guy here at school because that would be awkward. Especially since they're probably, you know, seeing someone. Or maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I just think they're, I, they, um, they're cute. They're good looking. And then upon talking to them, getting to know them recently, uh, a few times talking to them, I'm like, oh. So they also have a great pers personality. Oh, crap. I'm so screwed. So now I like them even more. Which is not good because, um... I don't know. I'm just kind of liking people that are way out of my um, league. Maybe they're not out of my league and maybe I'm just not confident about it. But anyways, um, yeah. The girl at, I was at the body shop. And if you haven't been to the body shop, then ugh, I don't know how to explain it to you. But this amazing uh, little store, they don't do animal testing. And they sell, you know, like natural or they're just really cool perfumes and makeup and body wash and like there's this really cool like scent your own shampoo and you put this like you buy the like per you buy the perfume and you can put scent in yourself anyways I was hanging out there and then they were closing and the girl let me hang out there didn't even have to buy anything she's like let me hang out and get to know stuff because she's like yeah you come here all the time which is sad because I've only ever bought one thing from there but she's like yeah you're here all the time so you may as well and um that's my life basically yeah uh school's going well like I said um and I guess everything's good. The protest went well, I believe. And um, other than my horrible crush that I do not know how to deal with, everything's good. And I just realized that I'm always, like, right underneath 10 minutes with these things because I can never stop talking. I need to be a director so that I can get longer vlogs so they don't seem really long yet rushed. You know what I mean? Uh, anyways, I should sign off now. Bye, YouTube. Catch y'all later.